Disappointed in people. I think, I don't know why I, sh why I am. Probably shouldn't be because Trump is our president. And when you see how he talked about someone like John McCain, after all, he's done for our country. And then we still put someone like him in office. And then we see my father who's done so much for this country, gone to war, Civil Rights Act, um, Violence Against Women Act, many other things. And I'm not saying if, if my father is guilty of these things, though he denies them, if he's guilty of these things, then of course, he deserves whatever punishment may come. But I think that it's, it's very unfortunate to see him fight so long for so many people and to automatically have the allegations assumed true. And of course, with sexual assault, women are to be believed. But in this instance, he has no history of this. And I think that if we're not going to make someone like Al Franken resign, we have evidence of him groping a woman while she was asleep at that, asleep at that, I should say. I think it's very, it's disconcerting to me to see the way my father's being treated after he's given so much to this country. Not just for black people, but for people alike. Fights for, fights for everyone. Do um, you believe these allegations? I do not, but I am not able to speak specifically to anything. Although I, I know, like, I know who the anonymous person is. I'm not able to speak specifically to that uh, because that's still being worked out. Um, Have you and your family, has your father addressed this with the family? Are you guys discussing it as a family? Well, I'm not going to talk about, you asked me what I had to say. So I'm not going to talk about what my family discusses. But um, yeah, it's very, it's funny. You do so much for someone and they do, they do things to hurt you when they can no longer take from you. Um, and I'll leave it at that because I have a fight to catch. But you all have a great morning.